Hi folks, welcome back. As you can see, I got the parts back from the powder coaters today. That's the little closure panel. Uh, the brackets for the rear bumper. The brackets for the front bumper. And the all important, massive bit of pig iron that goes behind the bumper. And the bumper itself. Take you down to this other side and let's have a better look. looks lovely few wee pits and whatnot on it but obviously that's the the condition of the bumper I also dropped the grill into Dan the fabricator the day and he's uh, welded in a little plate for me so much appreciated really appreciate that because I ain't got the time or the skill so I uh, rubbed in this, when I came in from work tonight, I've rubbed in this arch. There's one little hole there. Other than that, the arch is absolutely mint. I don't know what all the filler and whatnot was for. But again, who knows, there's a little dink there. So I put some back tan in that. There's another one up, up high level. Another little one there. So, mission tomorrow is get the windows out get where they've got the, the taped up holes here I need to get something so that the painter can paint I say really I love the colour it's actually Land Rover Ivory so uh, RAL codes 1001 if anybody wants to know so I'm going to put a little bit of Actan on this plate just to protect it until it gets to the painter just stops the, the metal rusting because the painter will obviously be putting filler and whatnot on it so I don't want to put primer and all that on primer, the, the filler prefers to go on bare metal so uh, there's like the, the little pits where the the spot welds are between the two two sections of metal so I'll let him deal with that as I say I don't want to go too far with it and get the way step in his toes and how he likes to prepare things everybody does it different as you can see piss the rain Saturday I just dug out all the seam sealer from the joints between the wing and the step the inner step and uh, got some vac tan on and the heavens opened it done this to me all day I was seriously seriously brushed off as you can see today's another day wee bit of sunshine well dry anyway so I managed to get these rubbed back out again put a piece of wood to fill the hole for the fridge vent I've got a drinks cup <laughs> in the, the mains hook up hole working my way around I've got an old roll of duct tape fills that hole and a little piece of wood fills that hole so yeah we're getting there as I say, the weather was absolutely atrocious Saturday. Every time I came out, here we go. What a difference a day makes. Sunday, the sun is cracking the flags. I've had a really good day. I've managed to grind these all back out again where I put the vac tan in. Got it revac tan, it looks well. I've been up, took the skylight off, took away all the old adhesive. As I say, the skylight was only put in temporary uh, because I was never happy. And I must say a massive thanks to Kev Elwood, Kev the legend that is, came and joined me today and helped me out to take the, the windows out and 
grind round the gutters and stuff and just a massive massive help to me so again top man so we got the windows out today we boarded them up and uh, sealed them we've done the back door windows same again took all the silicon and that out and uh, yeah there we go my patented door handle zip tie now as I was saying it means that the painter can just flat to the panels and paint right over I've got the little cup fill in the electric hookup door handles all off the aerial hole I'll see if I can get the painter to maybe mig that in I've just not either got the skill or the energy and I've not got gas for the welder so uh, I think we're basically there it's a uh, it's good to go to the painters, well it need to be good to go to the painters because it's going to the painters tomorrow morning. As you can see, this is it from the inside. It's just a couple of lengths of uh, the shower board that was left over. I've put some decorator's cock. Obviously I can't use silicon, silicon based products. So I've used the, set, the decorator's cock. There's a couple of wee bits I've missed. So I'll let it go off and I'll come back on it again later on just before I finish up tonight. But yeah, really pleased. So we've had a bit of a mission. It's been a weekend of ups and downs. The rain dropped on me uh, today. But I had to take the panel off the back of this this panel here in order to get to the door handle because the the nut and the bracket for the door handle are right in line with the cupboard surprise surprise but anyway that's him he's all prepped and ready so I'm dropping him off at the painters tomorrow and I'll be able to do the click my fingers trick and it'll be a different colour so from me and the wee man that's all for now tada folks <laughs>